guys, it's Chloe here. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So today guys, I've been at work and I didn't realise that this would be coming today. I thought it would be coming tomorrow, which would be Tuesday, but you'll be seeing this on a Wednesday. So, I received this here parcel from, I don't know where, hmm, I wonder which company it was from. Yeah, I ordered this parcel. If it is what I think it is, it's another character to add to my shalike horse herd and I'm gonna let you guys name him or her. So, it kind of gives it away what's in there, but without further ado, we're gonna open up this parcel and check out this figure for ourselves. Okay, so I've blacked out my address because you don't need to know where I live. So, open it up. Ah, oh, there it is! There's the figure. Oh my god, she is beautiful. She is beautiful. She is beautiful. She is so beautiful and guinea pigs don't know when to shout out when I'm filming. Look at that. She is gorgeous. Look at her. So she is the Tinker Mare. And oh my god, I love her. She's gorgeous. Now, the role she's going to play in my horse herd is this character. Okie dokie guys, so how this mare is going to fit in with my herd is she is going to fit in with Duke's family. So Duke is this horse here and if you have seen my horse collection video and background information about it, he is the leader of the herd and he has a daughter which he has raised himself because he has somehow his mate she wasn't there or she died giving birth to his daughter this is his daughter by the way moonbeam uh, she wasn't around for some reason this mare guys you can either decide can be a new love interest to duke or she can be moonbeam's long lost mother and she's just returned out of the blue and we can kind of build a backstory from that if you guys want that i kind of would like to see that because it adds a bit of tension, like, you know, Moonbeam's going to be wondering, where has my mum been all these years? Why has she not been with me? And why has it just been me and my dad? And there could be something there that caused her mum to leave, or perhaps humans caused her mother to leave or something. No one knows. That's kind of the family unit I want to fit her into. She can either be a new love interest to Duke. So Duke falls in love with this new mare and they're together how will that affect his relationship with his daughter and his grandson son colt you guys can des decide that and think that for yourselves but yeah that's kind of what i'm edging towards with the this herd with adding this mare in so any name suggestions leave them down below in the comments okie dokie guys so that is today's video i hope you enjoyed I know it's been a little short, but that is kind of the idea behind this new segment that I'm adding to the channel. Because I get most of my Shalike Papo figures online, I think that if I open them and then explain how I want the relationships to go within the collection they're going into, or starting up a new collection for example, I can get your guys' input on it and you guys can, you know, give me like some stories behind these characters. like. This mare, for instance, who is she going to be? Is she going to be a long lost mother slash grandmother? Or is she going to be a new love interest within the herd and the new head mare or f head female of the herd? Who knows? Because I'm actually looking forward to reading it. It's kind of like sitting and hearing someone telling you a bedtime story or just reading like a story. It's kind of why I like to give all my herds backstories. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a massive thumbs up because that lets me know you want to see more of these in the future because I plan on doing a lot more of these in the future. Leave some comments down below. Some positive feedback is always very gratefully appreciated. And give this mare a backstory and a name. She needs a name, guys. The person with the best name, I'll give them a shout out and... I'll link that channel below. If you want this mare for yourself, 
I'll leave the link to where I got her down below in the description. I'll start doing that with this series, so when I buy figures, I'll link to them where I bought them below, so you guys can go check it out for yourselves. And finally, if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. As I am filming this, we are now at 330 subscribers, which is amazing. So thank you guys so much for that. Thank you guys so much for all the support. It is amazing. And I will be seeing all you beautiful people a Friday for another video. Uh, bye bye!